Evan Murray back out here day four, day two in pads. Everyone got the day off yesterday, so we're pretty fresh out here. Intensity is definitely picking up considering that everyone's still fighting for spots and even tempers flaring a little bit. Let's go check out the action. the same as yesterday. I mean, there's moments where we get frustrated as players as coaches, and there's moments where I'm thinking, okay, they understand it. But, you know, I think it's probably a typical day four, probably about where I thought we'd be, or not where I'd hope we'd be, but about where I thought we'd be on day four. What gets you the most frustrated? Oh, we probably don't have time to list it all. But, you know, mental mistakes, uh, effort, you know, uh, lack of execution, the typical stuff. You know, the things that get me the most excited is when we don't have those things. So well, this little bit, I think their their um, intentions are are really good. So that's the most important. Thing, that positive attitude. For those of us who can't see all of practice, what stood out to you the most, either positive or negative, tonight for the last couple of days? Oh, it didn't rain. You know, we we had lightning, but it was like way in the distance. So uh, that was my worry at six o'clock practices. So for two days in a row, we've avoided. So our luck has been good so far. How much uh, do you see Hank Hobson contributing this year to the defense? Hank's going to play a lot. He had a good spring. He's a tough guy. You know, he got some experience last year before he was ready, probably. And uh, I think it'll serve him well. And, and I really like Hank. I think he's, he, you know, we're, that's our thinnest position. And, and uh, Hank has, has shown that uh, he's going to be able to contribute. You done the board drill at previous stops, and I mean, how oh, yeah. do the guys get? Obviously, they love that type of one-on-one. -on -one yeah, I think they like competing. It's, that's why they kids play PlayStation, Nintendo, and stuff. You know, there was a competition, and that's true one-on-one. -on -one. There's a winner or loser, and and the fun part for me is I get to pick who wins and loses. Uh, but it, we'll do it just about every day in pads, and I don't think there's there's some relation to that to football, you know, as far as leverage and all that. But you know, normally there's not very most time in football where two guys are lined up like this and just bang and don't do much else or anything else, but it's fun. So how was today? Um, I think I did. I had a pretty good practice today. I think I made some good catches, proving myself to the coaches. And what is the schedule like as far as when camp goes? Do you have curfew, anything like that? Um, yeah, they're very strict on curfews, 11 o'clock every night. I mean, they keep us busy like every, every hour throughout the day, except we get like a little break, two hour break, and then we're back at it. You had the day off yesterday. What did you do, and did you eat any good food? Um, it wasn't really a day off. We had meetings and stuff, and then um, we all had um, dinner at our coach's house. We had brush fire, so it was pretty good. So how was today? Intense, fun. I mean, we start our first day of pads tomorrow, so it was a good day. With half of your pads being on, how has the intensity picked up? I mean, a lot. I mean, we're thudding up, and we can't take each other down. They don't want to hurt each other, so it was just a little more intense. You had the day off yesterday, or a kind of day off. How was that, and did you eat any good food? I ate a lot of good food. Um, yeah, I just had a lot of good food, that's all. I mean, I ate, slept all day. It's about chilling on the couch, watch film, that's it. And as far as a schedule when fall camp starts, is there a curfew? What's it like? Um, yeah, there's curfew every night. Um, I mean, they're just on top of everything. They give us a little bit of free reign. They trust us, but they're on top of everything.